Welcome to yet another edition of the Cougar Close-Up here on Shaw TV. This week, we feature second-year Cougars defenseman Shane Collins. Originally drafted by the Cougars in the third round of the 2012 WHL Bantam Draft, Shane Collins has now played over 100 games in the Western Hockey League, all with Prince George. We'll hear from Shane about what he feels have been the greatest improvements to his game over the course of his career and what it takes to stay in the lineup on a game-by-game -game basis. All of that and much more with Cougars defenseman Shane Collins here on the Cougar Close-Up on Shaw TV. Just tell me about the season as a whole up to this point and just the confidence that you've taken away from it to this point. Uh, yeah, it's definitely a lot better than last year. Coming back second year, have games a little slower. Uh, you feel like you can control it a little more and uh, I think I've found definitely some success and had more opportunities this year. Let's just talk, uh, let's go back to the very beginning. It's draft day in 2012. You hear your name called early on by the Prince George Cougars and you know, I mean, I know coming to your first WHL training camp, I'm sure there's a bit of nerves, but I mean, just tell me about the first experience and maybe how the, the transition has gone. Uh, all of a sudden, you're 19 as opposed to 15. I'm sure that's got to be different as far as uh, uh, the psychology of it all is concerned. Yeah, definitely. I remember when I got drafted, I didn't really have a clue about anything with Prince George, but came to my first camp and uh, I mean, it's a nice rink, uh, it's a nice city and and then just over the years, the new ownership, everything's changed so much. It's it's been awesome. It's just been a great place to play now. I uh, we talked recently actually about uh, the first 100 games of your career. You recently played uh, in your 100th game, your first game in Moose Jaw, the same place that you played your midget. But uh, let's think about your career up to this point, Shane. Was there a moment, maybe a goal? Was it was it a game where you really thought, okay, I've arrived. I belong here. Uh, yeah, I think a couple games maybe earlier this year, just like controlled the play quite a bit and nobody was beating me and I thought, you know, this is definitely where I belong and I can, I can play at a high level here, make an impact. Tell me about the mindset coming into this season and collectively was there uh, maybe an added confidence among the guys knowing that this season there would be higher expectations? Uh, yeah, definitely. I mean, last year we got a taste of the playoffs and we knew we had a better team this year. We have, definitely have a better roster. and. And uh, we've kind of we've had lots of success this season. We've struggled a bit of late, but we know we know the team we can be, and we definitely look to go deep into the playoffs. Tell me just about some of the things that you've credited Shane over the course of the past season or two that have kind of put you in the situation where you are today. Uh, yeah, I just kind of try to stick to the same details every game and just do what the coaches are teaching, and and hopefully they build their confidence in you and give you more opportunity, and then you just get your chance to grow as a player. Just tell me, Shane, about just some of the keys for the Prince George Cougars down the stretch as you get uh, set for that second season. Uh, we're just going to have to play fast and uh, be structured, definitely stick to our game plan. Whenever we get away from that, we tend to struggle with teams and maybe let them off the hook a little bit. But if we stick to our game plan, our structure, uh, I think there's not, not too many teams that can stick with us. One thing about uh, Shane Collins that some fans might not know is the fact that you were named the Academic Player of the Year for the Prince George Cougars, receiving the Dr. Jeff Zorn Award, one of the new awards created in the new Ice Age. What did it mean to you, Shane, to, to experience that and receive that award, the first uh, official recipient of that Dr. Jeff Zorn Award last season? Uh, yeah, it was a good honor. Uh, I got a chance to meet him when he came up here a few weeks ago. He was honored here. and. Uh, I mean, he had a successful career and definitely nice to get his award. Shane Collins, I know that uh, many are excited to see what this team is capable of down the stretch and into the playoffs. You've had a great season. Congratulations on your personal sex to, uh, success to this point. All the best down the road, my friend. Thanks for this. Thank you. Thanks for joining us on Shaw TV for another edition of the Cougar Close-Up. Make sure you join us next week as we continue to feature the Prince George Cougars in their march towards the 2015-16 WHL playoffs. For more information on tickets, scheduling and more, check out the Prince George Cougars website at www.pgcougars.com.